Hello, it's me, Martin. That's what I look like when I show you some flail stuff. Today we will have a look on how to change the direction of your blow without committing suicide. First let's have a look on some basics with a sword. If you have to change the direction of your blow abruptly, you can stop the blade with your body like this. Obviously, performing this move with a flail is not a good idea for various reasons. A basic defensive stance with a sword is a high guard like this. As you can see, this high guard covers almost your whole body and you can quickly strike around and deflect any blow that comes at you. When fighting with a flail, this high guard protects you from hitting yourself. Pointing away from you is crucial. You can take even more energy out of the weapon when you lower its level after adopting the high guard. Another thing you can do is catching the chain. Just slide your upper hand along the chain like this. It's possible on both sides, but I recommend to do it after a backhand strike. On the other side, after a forehand strike, the move gets way too complex. As long as you turn yourself in the same direction as your blow, you don't have to worry that much. Just keep up the momentum and focus on the moment when you want to change the direction. Adopt your high guard and continue on the other side. You can start to train this by starting from your high guard, striking once and then return into high guard. When you feel safe with this, extend your footwork and the number of blows. Combine up and downward blows and maybe add a little turn in between.
And if you want to do him a favor, leave a like and subscribe.